What's going on? This is Azraf, and in this episode of my journey as a content creator, we're going to talk about one of the lines of updates and changes along with the channel. The first one being that the Blasphemous series is done; its DLC is following up, but we're not going to we're not going to make it a Let's Play series since it's only a New Game Plus, and I feel I would be reiterating what I already done in the first season. So we're gonna make that into a streaming series, so that way if we find anything new, it'll be there already versus it, you know, pushing on 20 some episodes. <laughs> also, I wanted to make Death's Door our main series, but for, you know, viewer reasons, it wasn't doing so well on the channel. I, I didn't feel comfortable making it. You know, just the main series and then just putting off something else because I, I wasn't happy with it. Um, some of the changes, I had to move, move things around, make sure everything was in a very good schedule, but I felt the best thing to do for me in this situation was to make Subnautica the main part of the series because one, I enjoy playing it as many times as I played it. I, I always go in there and something new always happens and it always pops up and I've been wanting to put this on the channel for some time. So Subnautica is going to be our main series for the three episodes. Then we're going to have Death Door going back to our one episode per week. Uh, Osiris New Dawn is leaving us because I felt, I felt the game didn't have any, it didn't have a path for the channel to follow. I was just kind of setting things up on my own as I went and saying, okay, we're going to do this for today and then we're going to be done. Okay, we're going to do that for today and be done. But I didn't feel the same excitement seven episodes later. The same way I would feel um, recording Subnautica and finding things there. The developers for Osiris New Dawn want to make the game of great quality. They want you to be there to play it and enjoy it versus you you know, getting something that was quickly put out, and it's like, well, here you go, this is it. And you're like, what? What is this? And then you just walk away from it. So I wholeheartedly agree with them that they should take this route, and we'll come back to it later on, but for now, we have an empty slot on our schedule. So Icarus vs. Cohort is going to fit into that Let's Play series, but we're going to be playing it offline rather than online. The reason we're doing it offline is because I've been having so many issues um, streaming it as well because I can't play it online and stream it at the same time. It, it's just weird. Uh, my internet just disconnects and all of a sudden I, I can't play it. I'm like, why? Why is this happening? <laughs> so at this point, we're going to make it a Let's Play series with me just playing offline on my own. And if we can, we might. I don't think I'm going to go back to streaming if we're going to do the whole Let's Play thing. We're going to see how it works out, and if it does work out to the point where it's a Let's Play, then I believe that's going to be our once a week kind of thing. But if you think about it, if we do do it once a week, then it, it should be streaming, because... No, no, I take that back. We are going to go ahead and do it a Let's Play. The reason why that's the best thing to do, and I've thought about this all day and kept flip-flopping, is because if I'm playing it offline and then making the series, then I won't have to run into any issues. I won't have to consistently make corrections. It'll just be a straight Let's Play, and that'll be done with it. What else? I tried to use my phone instead of this camera at, for editing. It, it didn't work out. I couldn't transfer the video over, and when I tried to do it on iMovie, for some reason, I just didn't feel comfortable using the technology on my phone. I would rather use it on the desktop. And the last few changes is the channel itself. With these kind of updates, I think this is generally becoming more of just the channel update rather than, you know, my life as a content creator. I feel that this is probably a good direction for the channel to move. I was on the fence about whether or not I wanted this to happen because this was supposed to be documenting, you know, what's happening so far in the beginning content creation. But I think this is more, like I said earlier, a channel update versus what I'm doing with podcasts and, uh, and blogs. So 
I started delving into blogging about my journey as a content creation and just putting my thoughts and feelings into that rather than the vlog itself. And there's also podcasts where I read these out loud and they're there for you to listen if you want to listen, if you want to read them, they're there to read. So a lot's been changing, a lot's been happening. I'm, ho I'm hoping it's for the better because it seems like it's for the better. And with that said, we're going to go ahead and get on with this week. It is almost Christmas time. Um, go out there and get those presents because there's just, there's still a few I need to grab. I already got my wife covered, so I just need to get the rest of the family. Um, we're going to go ahead and end it right now. Um, I'm just so lost and flabbergasted because there's all these changes and I'm like trying to figure all this out as I go. But I think, yeah, I think it will work out in the end. Be sure to like and subscribe, hit that notification bell on the way out, and I will see you in the next episode.